everyone and welcome to vlogmas day 12. So I don't really know what I'm planning on doing today. I do know that I need to go to the post office and thanks to you guys signing up with my food codes down below, I was able to get some food for not much money today. So I got some sandwiches from Firehouse that I'm waiting on. So I am waiting on that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open the next day of the Arteza advent calendar. We are on day 10 now. Oh no, sorry. I meant to say that we're on day 11. I don't know why I said day 10. Okay, so day 11 is down here and it's pretty small so I'm going to guess that it's probably some type of paint. Yes, I was right. Oh, it's two paints. Cute. So we have two little pans of, I don't even know if this is watercolor or not. I'm assuming it's watercolor. We've got the pan plum purple and cerulean blue. I don't know if I said that right. Here's what they look like. So now I have a bunch of these like little individual pans, so that's really cool to have. All right, so that was what I got in the advent calendar today. I have been on TikTok yesterday and my For You page, for some reason, has been a lot of cleaning videos. I'm kind of in the mood to go like scrub my bathroom and kitchen. May go away in a little bit where I don't feel like doing it, but I'm gonna do some cleaning today. I am going to show you my P.O. Box packages today. And to be honest, I don't really know what else I'm going to do. I pre-edited my other vlogmas video last night so I didn't have to do that this morning so that saved me a lot of extra time in my day and uh, there's nothing else that I really need to do. I think I'm going to make some of my more Christmas stickers for my shop because um, a lot of you guys have asked me if I could restock the cat Christmas stickers so I'm at least going to try to stock the cat Christmas stickers for you guys and get those out this afternoon and try to get those shipped out as soon as possible so I think I'm actually going to do that right now. Those are the only ones I'm going to be able to restock in the time that I have right now unfortunately. So if you were looking for my Christmas cat stickers, those will be restocked but I don't know how many I'm going to be able to make. All right, I just got my food from Firehouse. I haven't had Firehouse in a while, actually. I don't know why, because their sandwiches are actually very good. So I was actually able to get two sandwiches for my discount. This will be able to last me two separate meals, which is pretty cool. So I just got a small meatball sub. I've never had their meatball sub before, and I wanted to get something hot that I can just heat back up later. So this is not gonna be what I eat right now, but this is probably gonna be what I eat for dinner or eat tomorrow. Then for lunch today, I just got like a basic sub sandwich this is the medium size because I mean that's all I really need it just has like ham turkey melted cheese lettuce there's other stuff on it too but I don't remember and it comes with a pickle which is my favorite then I just got a side of chips the chips come with the sandwich so I just got some salt and vinegar chips which are probably gonna kill my throat right now then I got some cookies because I don't have any chocolate at home right now and I just really need some chocolate and then I got a cup of loaded baked potato soup because as many of you guys know my favorite food is loaded baked potato soup and the side with with the one of the sandwiches both sandwiches came with a side so I got chips as a side and then I also got um, baked potato soup so I'm probably going to save the chips for my meatball sub and then today I'm going to eat the loaded baked potato soup and their soup also comes with these little oyster crackers, which is super cute. I love how I'm talking about how food is cute because food is cute to me. So I just once again want to thank you guys for using my codes and links and stuff so I can get discounted foods. Um, I spent $15 on all of this food, including the tip. I got two meals for $15, which is just awesome. So thank you guys. I hope you're enjoying your discounted food as well, but this really helps me have some good food because this looks so good right now. Okay guys, as you can see, I just got back from the post office. It was crazy. Like I'm out of breath there were so many people I felt so bad because the Amazon packages were delivered two hours ago to them and they hadn't even uh, like scanned them in yet so I felt bad like going into the front office and asking the ladies if I could get them because I didn't want to come back another day you know so yeah I felt kind of bad about that but the the ladies at my post office are so nice but I could just tell that they were flustered I mean you could just see the packages everywhere it was crazy so yeah I have one two three four boxes and then I have a couple letters and this little package and most of these are Christmas presents or just random stuff so I'm just gonna go through this one first because I know what this is this is actually for my guinea pigs for their enclosure this is not a Christmas present I mean I guess it could be a Christmas present for the guinea pigs but so all of their liners come in this cardboard box 
that you can also use as a hidey home for your guinea pigs, which I do use it for my guinea pigs, and they love the crap out of these boxes, so I use all of them. All right, so I already have, I think, four or three or four guinea dad liners, and I knew that they sold this print, and this is definitely Christmas vibes. They sell it all year round, but I got this liner for Christmas time, and this is gonna go in their enclosure when I decorate for Christmas this weekend. And then I will go through this book outlet box. Um, this is not my reading channel, but this is a Christmas present to someone, so that's why I'm showing it in this video. Book outlet is a pretty cheap book website where basically they sell books for like three or four dollars each. Sometimes they're used, sometimes they're not. Oh, by the way, if anybody in my family is watching this or friends, then stop watching because you will probably get spoiled for a Christmas present. Okay, so I got this one for my dad because it sounded like a pretty cool story. So this is called Erebos, I think that's how you say it, and it's by Ursula Pos Posnowski. It's about like a computer game that you can get like stuck in, and that definitely just sounds like something my dad would like. And honestly, I would probably like it as well. It says, it's a game, it watches you. And this book, I think was only a couple dollars, let's see. Oh, it doesn't say it on the invoice, but I know it was like two or three dollars for a hardcover. And then I actually got this for myself, it's called Create Your Own Bath Bombs, because I had a rewards on Book Outlet, and sometimes there's just not anything on book outlet and I needed to get something else to be able to use my full reward so I got those two for free. This is a 24 page recipe book and ingredients to create four bath bombs and many of you guys know I love that so this would be a really good type Christmas present for somebody if they like bath bombs but I don't really know anybody who would want to make any themselves, so I just got this for myself since it was free. I'm really excited for this. Let me know down below if you want me to film me making these. That was box number two. Now we have the Amazon packages. So this is a book for my dad for Christmas. It's called Legend Born by Tracy Dion. I don't really know what it's about, but it was on his Amazon wish list, so I picked it up. I've seen a lot of booktubers actually talk about this book, but I don't really know anything about it. So it, I mean, the cover is absolutely stunning. So yeah, I got this for my dad because it was on his wish list. And then this package right here. I don't think the post office ladies gave me all of my packages because there was another book that I was waiting on. So I'm probably just gonna go have to go back another day and, and get the rest of the packages, but I knew that they were busy, so I didn't wanna like push them. Yeah, there's actually two more things that they didn't give me, but it's okay. Okay, maybe in the morning I can go back and see if they're there. So this is actually for my pets for Christmas. This is a cute flower pet fountain. It comes with a filter. Anybody who knows Spectra knows that Miss Spectra over there loves to play with the water bowl. And I feel like she would have a lot of fun playing with a water fountain. And I wanted to get something that is filtered for them. So yeah, we'll test this out in this video and see how that works out. Yeah, so that was what is in all the boxes. In reality, I guess only two of those things were Christmas presents because some of the stuff is probably still at the post office so then I know this one is definitely a Christmas present this is something I got off of Etsy and this is for my sister I'm definitely gonna keep this in the original packaging because it looks so adorable but I got this Melanie Martinez pin for my sister oh it looks so good Melanie Martinez is me and my si sister's favorite artist, one of our favorite artists, and I found this pin on Etsy, and I thought it was super cute, so I got that for kind of just as like a little gift, and it also comes with Melanie stickers. So I also got my sister a pair of Lolita stockings for Christmas that was on her Amazon wish list, and a fluffy pink rug for her room, which is what the other packages were supposed to be from Amazon. So I'm gonna put all of these in one package together, kind of as like a little Lolita pink package. So that's what that's gonna do. All right, and that's all of the packages I wish I could have shown you guys more, but unfortunately I didn't get all of them today So hopefully in the vlog tomorrow you guys will see some more packages probably like I just think two more And then the last one is going to be delivered on Monday And then I think I'm going to do my gift wrapping video on Tuesday or Wednesday of next week I'm not 100% sure on that yet things might change, but that's what I'm thinking so far all of these cool things right here only three of them being Christmas presents though. Well, I guess the animal stuff is Christmas presents for my animals So I can't say that those are presents because they are they just my animals just don't understand that they're presents I put the new water thing down and she's already starting Like I don't think she understands where the water is coming from. It's super quiet though You can't even hear it and it's filtered water looks like a little water fountain So we shall see in the morning if Spectre completely knocks this whole thing over. What is she doing? <laughs> 
One cool thing about it is that it comes with a silicone mat, so if this thing is like moved, it's gonna be really hard for the animals to be able to push it around because it's kind of stuck onto that mat. But I mean, she is, I knew she would be the first one over here playing with it because she it has just a weird obsession with water. And I don't know why, like, she enjoys the shower. She enjoys being sprayed by water bottles. Like, she's the weirdest cat I've ever met. Okay, guys, so it is 11.30 at night, and I haven't really been doing much for the rest of the night. My parents came over a little bit for a little bit because um, my mom bought me some new jeans for Christmas, but I... She's not wrapping them because I've kind of grown out of all of my jeans. I've had them since like the beginning of high school and I've gained weight since then. So I needed some new jeans and I don't like spending a lot of money on clothes. So she bought me two pairs of jeans for Christmas. I haven't even eaten anything. I have a headache. It's not a migraine yet, but it's definitely like I need to go to sleep now or it's going to turn into a migraine, you know? I'm not going to edit the video tonight. I like to edit them at night so I don't have to do anything the next morning, but I'm going to edit this tomorrow morning. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow yet. There's a lot of plans that have kind of gone just up and down. I'm supposed to go Christmas shopping and then I'm not going to go Christmas shopping because I don't really want to be out in public right now. But I may go later in the night where I just go eat dinner with my grandparents. So I don't really know how it's happening. But and then I'm also planning on decorating a guinea pig enclosure for Christmas tomorrow. I'm not sure about the rat one yet, but definitely the guinea pig one. So I'm excited for that. And hopefully I'll have that pet video up on like Saturday or Sunday. So if you made it this far in the video, then leave a little sunflower emoji down below so I know you made it this far. Make sure to check out my other channels down below. I have a pet channel and a reading channel. And also my social media is like my Patreon where I make exclusive content, my Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!